Hello Pisces and welcome to your love career study self-improvement. If this is your first time here, thank you, thank you, thank you for showing up. Okay? Thank you, thank you, thank you for showing up. Okay? For those who are new, thank you for being here. If you like the content, you know, subscribe. For 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 all my people that are here today, if you like the content, please do like the channel. Like the video, please. Okay, this is for your career here, your overall art for your career. And then for self-improvement, keep in mind, Pisces, I've already shuffled these cards. Okay, so what we have here is um, Autumn, okay, is in your love here. And then we have for career, we have all greatness teeters on whether a world would-be hero overcomes the terror within and advances regardless okay and in your self-improvement we have loyalty okay so we'll start off with that okay so when it comes to love all right let's start off with that first we have the five of pentacles okay when it comes to career we have the five of swords okay and we'll have a clarity card ready and then when it comes to self-improvement, under loyalty, we have judgment, okay? And we'll have a card here for, clar for clarification in a minute. Okay, Pisces. What I'm seeing is in love, it says something about autumn. Now, we have the card of five of pentacles. Five is all about conflict, okay? Five is all about um, change. Something um, is confusing, okay, when it when it comes to you, okay? Um, so I'm feeling like at this time, when it comes to love, you are definitely feeling like um, cold right now. You are feeling like you are out in the cold, okay? You are feeling isolated and alone when it comes to love at this point okay but the overall card says autumn so we'll continue to kind of go about how that plays out okay so it says um if you know something is um bothering you um but you have to keep moving okay with this career card okay so you know Sometimes we don't know how things are going to work out at work, okay? But anyway, we have some type of conflicts going on at work, okay? And, you know, um, it could be just, you know, people around you um, are, you know, like just telling you what to do too much or the people that are in charge are kind of like, you know, um, it's just not really good leadership. Okay. So with the five of swords, it's just basically, you know, letting you know that there's changes going on, you know, um, at work. Okay. That are not good. There's a lot of fights and a lot of conflicts going on. Okay. When it comes to your personal improvement, it says loyalty. Um, and then you have also the judgment card, okay? And the judgment card is just finding clarity on what you need in your life, okay? Finding judgment on um, what you need to focus on, okay? And make, you know, final decisions on what you need to do, okay? Now, this could be in your, this is, this could be something concerning your love life, okay? That you're really worried about here in your self-improvement that you have to get past. Um, you see this heart here? So, you know, you got to get past um, the heart loss and the heartbreak and you need to heal, okay? Your second card here is um, Page of Pentacles, okay? So you have thoughts on what you want to do in love, okay? And, you know, messages might come about on what you need to do, okay, um, when it comes to love. Maybe some um, new, 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 new ideas when it comes to um, moving forward, okay? When it comes to your career, um, less is more. Intuition is key, keeping to yourself. So basically with this five of swords energy and this saying all greatness overcomes the terror within. Okay, so this is got to do with the high priestess with this first card here as well. So, you know, you need to go within um, and be guided right now. You need to pull back um, and trust yourself when it comes to people because people, you know, are um, in your environment are not honest with you. So it's just saying that you need to pull away because of these conflicts, go within yourself and leave 
um, all the chaos alone, because you see all that in work, there's just not, um, people are just not being honest and you just need to just, you know, do less at, you know, dealing with people. Okay. With your personal development here, you have justice. Wow. So you have justice and judgment. So it's definitely some type of um, balance that you may need. It's cause and effect. The truth is coming out, okay, with these two cards on how loyal um, you are to the relationship or how loyal they are to the relationship because you have judgment and justice here, okay? So, you know, it's a balancing act. It's a cause and effect with both of these. So I'm saying, you know, you don't, I don't know if it's either you or the other person, but something has to, um, come to fruition. Something will, truth will be moved forward into the light very soon. Okay. Um, or at this time. Okay. So let's pull one more card for love. So yeah, things are changing. Okay. And there's nothing you can do about it. Okay, so whatever you've been planning and ideas you've had about this isolation, um, things are definitely going to change. Okay, and the tower is all about um, all about immediate change. Like you know, when this happens, you don't know when it's going to occur, but things are going to change um, unexpectedly, and you know, it's about um, timing. Okay, and when things happen something has come to light and you know with the tower and it causes you to go a different pathway because of all the issues i don't know maybe that autumn card is there for a reason but anyway trust yourself when it comes to work with this high priestess here um and you know yeah at work is definitely um some type of conflict and chaos because you got the devil all these cards here is telling you to you know that it's conflict and you need to trust yourself and you have a you definitely have toxic people around you that um is not being honest okay Pis pisces so whoever your environment is um you need to work on that because three cards came in a row on what's going on at your job for you pisces okay and your final final inter you know, your final card for improvement is six of wands. Okay. Be confident. Okay. With this judgment and this justice, be confident. Cause if you are loyal, you are going to be victorious. Okay. And whatever you're doing here, um, Pisces, because this is self-improvement, you are going to move up. Okay. You are overcoming the obstacles, um, with this justice and this judgment card and your loyalty. Okay, so whatever this is involving, whether it be um, something personal, whether it be love or whether it be work, just understand that um, this is your main focus because this is you for self-improvement. So it's something that you're thinking about because in your relationships and at work, it seems like everything is just kind of beating you up right now, Pisces. And um, let's just hope for the better when it comes to that. Okay, we got two cards fall out for Pisces. So you can create your own calm is one of the cards for you, Pisces. And the other card is be yourself no matter what. Okay, Pisces, if this really does relate to you, can you please like the comments, please? And um, um, if it resonates any, can you please um, like the comments so I can know that whatever I am doing is, you know, some type of information that is resonating with you, okay? Um, if you're new here, um, please, if it resonates, like the video and subscribe. Thank you, Pisces. I hope to see you again. Take care. Bye.